we're going to want to just come right over here and take a look and see what the dart requires to be repaired. Okay. Now, let's see. Um, it's got a forward-facing thruster here, so it needs a forward-facing thruster here. Okay. Side thruster there. Oh, it looks like they uh, did a little remodel on the damaged dart here. Um, I guess that's a C for cargo. Um, this is very nice. This is a very nice uh, modification that they did here. Welcome back, everybody, to Know It All DM Entertainment. I'm Know It All DM. How's everybody doing today? I'm doing great. Hanging out, playing Imperial Galactic Survival. So I was out getting some resources so that we can start repairing the, uh, uh, whatchamacallit over there, the uh, dart. And I got a warning saying we had enemies incoming. Now, I've got a rocket drone out here, at least one. And I think that rocket drone is just patrolling out there but out here oh yeah out here we've got our major uh things over here these are what are attacking here so i'm gonna sit over here and try to take out some of these that are shooting at us there we go. I think our defenses did quite well. Didn't take a whole lot of damage, and what we did just hit the steel. Didn't, I don't think I took any rocket shots, so not bad. Oh, I need to um, <laughs> texturize that back to... Let's just do that. Okay. Yeah. So... Um, just took a few minigun shots, no actual rocket shots, hit the base. Very good. Very good. Our defenses did their job. Now let's come out here and loot these. I managed to just barely get back to the base, uh, with, uh, enough iron, copper, and silicon for just about anything. Now, where are these other drones? Out here. I hate that you can't see them and I'm being crap. Okay. Um, I'm going to have to, all right, let me come over here, grab these. I'm going to have to bike over to here. This is going to be close. And then bike back to the Heidelberg out here. Now, while, while I was out, I did take out a couple of drones and uh, uh, around the, uh, what do you call them? Around the uh, resource deposits. But unfortunately, um, there we go. Unfortunately, some of the uh, resource deposits, uh, the drones around there actually had a, uh, uh, they, they, it called a troop transport. And so a couple of times I had to fend off actual Xerox forces. This will warm me up as well. Um, but the Xerox forces that I had to deal with, uh, one of them, uh, when I was just over here taking care of this iron deposit, um, I actually got shotgunned by a Xerox that I missed. And so I've got one death. But uh, so far, that's all that I've died, which is actually really good if you think about it. Um, okay, so hover bike player yeah there we go i'll put this down uh here okay so we've got the resources we need or at least the main resources we need in order to repair the dart now what i need right now i need to get two of these and i think do i have the energy matrices i've got one energy matrix Hmm, which means I'm going to need a little bit of cobalt. 
We can grab that and throw it in here. Gonna need a little bit of cobalt to uh, make another energy matrix in order to make a second uh, door, second hangar door, which is unfortunate because I don't know exactly where I'm gonna go to get some cobalt. Um, I could try to make my way to uh, one of the several crashed capital vessels. And let me just go ahead and mark these. There's one there. Um, there's one here. And these are all really good capital vessels. Um, so I did a little bit of searching around the planet. All right, there's, yeah, there's that one. So that's one, uh, two, right? That's one, one here, one here. That's two. There's a third one up there. And then there was one more, or was that it? I thought there was one more that I had marked previously. I thought I had marked two. Um, this one over here. And one more that was up near the Prometheum deposit. Where's the Prometheum deposit? Or no, there's the Prometheum deposit down this way. No, the Prometheum deposit's down this way. That's the one that I marked there going to get Prometheum. Okay, yeah, that's right. We came down this way for Prometheum. And then uh, I came up this way and around here, did a little bit of searching uh, off camera. No, nothing really interesting, just found a few things, um, unknown artifacts and such that we can go and uh, loot when we, uh, once we get the, uh, uh, what do you call it done? Uh, once we get the dart online. All right, let me repair all this. This this is the damage the shotgun wielder did. Uh, one shot, he snuck up on me and shot me once. And uh, yeah, it wasn't very nice. But okay. I believe that is all of the damage. All right. So let's go ahead and start repairing the small vessel. I'll worry about getting that online once I'm done with that. So for the small vessel, I'm going to need, uh, first I do want a detector. Um, I'm gonna need thrusters and I think that's it. I'm gonna need a core thrusters. Um, I should go ahead and do that with the ammo box. I'm probably not gonna want to uh, use this. I might go ahead and medium thruster it and I'll see if I'll need a CPU, but I don't think I will. Um, landing gear, maybe, um, I've got the cockpits, armored cockpit would be nice, but I'll upgrade to that, um, if I need to, um, this is just going to be a little light scout, so it's not going to be a very combat capable vessel, let me do an RCS just in case I need it, okay, so, let's go out to the dart, and take a look and see exactly what it is we're gonna need. The dart's not too far away, so we're gonna wanna just come right over here and take a look and see what the dart requires to be repaired. Okay. Now, let's see. Um, it's got a forward-facing thruster here, so it needs a forward-facing thruster here. Okay side thruster there oh it looks like they uh did a little remodel on the damaged dart here um i guess that's a c for cargo um this is very nice this is a very nice uh modification that they did here um i guess g and f Generator and fuel, I suppose. And then turn that and that, put put a back thruster there. So I'm gonna need at least one, two, three,
And that was one, two, three. I might need more than that. Uh, four. I'll probably need a total of five, one in each direction. Um, is there a core on here right now? No, there's not. Oh, that's what goes up here. The core. C. Core. Okay. So, let's head back and uh, get back up into the Heidelberg. Let's see how our solar panels are doing because at one point they were on earlier, but it was during the day. Let's, uh, I wonder if it, it, it shows them off at night. That would be interesting. Um, because I think every time I've checked so far, it's been night. But let's just go ahead and rest until the morning. Okay. Um, let's see. Do I have solar power? I do not have any solar power. Maybe I just used it all up. Maybe I didn't have enough to begin with. Yeah, there's a little bit of solar power going on right now. It's not a whole lot, but there is some, which is really good. Okay. Um, our food situation is, again, running low. But once we get the uh, the small vessel online, it ought to be fine. So I'm going to do one for each direction. Just assume that there's six that are required. There's already a cockpit. Um, and then it said generator and fuel tank. It had locations for that. Once I get those input, I can bring it back here and actually do a little bit of extra modifications. We're going to want to move this out of the way, however. So let's just go ahead and move this out of the way. I'm just going to move it up over to here. We may end up using it again uh, to go around and gather wood, but for the most part, I don't think it's going to be very uh, useful once we get the small vessel online. So we're just going to move it off to the side and we'll have the hangar so we can just come down in here with the small vessel. Um, let's see, once all those are done, um, I may want to add an RCS. I should be able to go ahead and build it and then I want to upgrade those. And uh, we'll see what the bottom of the thing has. And uh, let's see, can I go ahead and make a couple of those? I'm probably not going to need more than two of these on there. Um, and if I'm going to do that, I might as well go ahead and make an ammo box. Um, I might want to use a couple of extensions, so not that many. I'm just going to go 10, and we'll see what that ends up looking like. I'm definitely going to want to put Wi-Fi on it. And I think that's it, at least for now. Oh, no, that detector. We're definitely going to want a detector because it's going to be a scout. So we're going to get all this stuff crafted up. How much fuel do I have? Eesh, we're running out of fuel. Um, let's see. That means I need to go get some Promethium. I'm actually going to head out while this is building, and I'm going to gather up some Promethium. Let's go see if I, our Promethium deposit, the one near where, the one that we have you know went to before, let's go see if that Promethium deposit... Uh, if the drone around there has regenerated, if so, we're definitely going to want to get that. We do need some more food, however. Hmm. I got a lot of things I got to do. Um, I'm actually going to go around, try to find some food, kill some, uh, kill some stuff for some more meat. And, uh, then I'm going to go get Prometheum and then I'm going to head back to the base and, uh, you know, I'll see you either when I'm over getting Prometheum because that'll probably be where I, uh, if if the drone has regenerated over there and uh, then I'm going to come back to the base and see you back at the base. So I'll be back once I've uh, gotten a little bit of extra stuff done off camera. All right. So before we go get more Promethean, we're going to use what we have here. Um, I've got it says two hours left of fuel. So that should be enough time to build up this. Uh, the Heidelberg or the, the, what do you mean, what do you call it? The thing on the, uh, the dart uh, for use with these. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to right now, let's see, what kind of fuel do we currently have? I don't think we have any fuel of any kind, um, which means I need to make, once you're done with those, let's just go ahead and make up, um, just make up a little bit of this, I don't know, a hundred, 
that should be more than enough that I'll use yeah more than that I can do uh let's just do 10 and that should be good okay and we'll put it all in the uh hover vessel while we go out and repair and then we'll come back and grab the fuel and uh, see if it's done making once we get back I might not be able to put all of this on the dart so let's go ahead take all these out and let's come just right over here uh, we may be within range of the Heidelberg, but I don't think so. I think we're just out. So let's go ahead. I'll just turn this. Actually, let me leave it on with the movement systems off so that I can come by and uh, and utilize. Oh, you don't have a... Uh, uh, that's right. You don't have a uh, Wi-Fi on you. So I guess I'll have to move these out of the way and just utilize this let's see I can oh, oh yeah it needs to put have the core first let's uh, grab the seriously seriously just because I'm moving you mm, I hate that all right we will probably end up moving the core to a different location um, what, let's see, what is this here? That's a thin steel block. Let's just grab that. And, uh, yeah, let's put the core down here. Um, like not right where the thing said it, but right, the right there ought to be good. So now we can actually pull this off as full blocks the question is do I really want to do that um I will start actually <laughs> yeah let's see what I uh, did they did it actually make the yeah it made these good 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 um I can actually pull these off yeah, I know, I know. And I can utilize these here. Now there's a space behind the core. Before I utilize this, let's get into here. Okay, um, let's put, okay, let's put these back in here for now. Grab this, let's pick this up off the ground, okay. So let's come in here, get a little bit more warm. Okay, once we get to 25, I should be good. Okay, there we go. Now, I want to go ahead and I'll put this here. Okay. And then this will go there and there. I think I should be able to put the fuel in generator all the way out here, but let's see. Um, the upper things, I'm not going to have a lot of cargo space on this. Let's see, is there another? I could make these the upper ones. That and that could be the upper ones so let's go ahead and retrieve that and this which are the down ones good 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 okay so let's see what we have here let's just get in here while we do our uh back and forth things <laughs> it's funny it gave us those those were actually the uh things in the back they were supposed to be small vessel ones but they gave us the large ones very interesting okay um i'm gonna go ahead and oh i can't put those down there crap okay uh let's just put them in here um i don't think i'm gonna put the rcs on just yet actually i can let me put this here let me just see what we can do i can replace the cargo box with that 
let's see what we have back here. Um, how does the back look? I can, uh, well, first let's see, is there, ooh, nice. Um, give me this, that's the cargo box. On the other side is a refrigerator. I'm not gonna really want that fridge. Um, at least not right there. I might move their, change, like, change their locations and, uh, put them in more accessible places, like over here, um, or something. I don't really see a good place to put the weapons unless I remove some of these. So if I take, uh, of course, of course, um, uh, hold on. Let me do this. Okay. So first I want to put the down facing one. That's, that's a given. And then we'll do a left or a, yeah, a port facing one here because that'll mirror the one over there. And then I will put the up facing ones where I said I would here, uh, there, and there. Okay. Now I really could put one here, but I think that's where I'm going to put the ammo box. Um, so I'm going to have the fuel and generators there, um, have the extended ones. Um, I can go ahead and pick this up. Uh, that means, let me see, I do still need a forward one. Okay, so let's put this like that. So I should have, let me check. That should have two in every direction, uh, left, except for left and right. Perfect, perfect. All right, let's come on in here. Um, I don't need my thrusters anymore. I'm going to hold off on the RCS, or am I going to put that on the top? Hmm, let me figure that out real quick. Um, I think up here on the very top is where I'm going to put the cargo box for the, uh, for the ammo, and I might replace these blocks around it with... Uh, container controllers or not controllers but the container extensions okay let's do this okay come out from here in there get back in so i can stay warm throw all this excess stuff in there i do have some fuel that i think i got that off of the drones which is really nice so okay now uh yes i know i need an art i can put the rcs and the detector on the interior where the fridge and the cargo box were. That's what I can do um, unless I want to put the generator and fuel tank over there and put those back there. Hmm. I could do that, put the generator and fuel tank sideways and then put in that square back there where I, that is, and then I can put, hmm. You know, I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to put the fuel tank here sideways, the generator. No, I'm going to put them this way. I know why. I know why. I'm going to put them. I. Uh... Okay, this is going to go here. This is going to go there. Um, I'm going to need a bigger fuel tank and generator. Um, these and this. And these are going to be my next things. I'll go back to the uh, to the Heidelberg to get the fuel tank and generator. Let's do this and these first. Okay, so that's up here on top. Now let me just make sure that these can get those angles. I don't think... All right, I think... You know, I really don't think I can. I don't think this angle is in there. What about that angle? I don't think that angle is in there either. Yeesh, this is going to be a little bit uh, difficult unless I redesign some of these, which I could do. But I don't think I want to do that. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to go ahead. I'm just going to pull off. What about this back thing? That's also carbon composite. Okay. Um, and so get this and this. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to put this here. I'm just going to leave it like that. We will 
put this, which is that angle, and this, which is this angle there. Um, let's see, if I take this off, okay, and put this back, um, do I have, yes. Okay, let's just do that. Okay, I know I'm about to get cold, but I should be able to do that. And then symbols. Um, it was... Aha! Now these, uh, I believe these were just white, were they not? White with the texture. Well, not, maybe not white, like that color. Um, or were they, I don't remember. I'm just gonna, let's just use these like that just to, for now, I'll see if I can go back and see what they, what texture they were. And I'll fix that later. You, I want to just go ahead and make white just to match the rest of it, even though you're going to be a, uh, thing. Okay. So I think it's all done. Oh, I need to go ahead and get my weapons in there. This, that. Well, hello. Um, okay. I'm definitely going to need to turn it upside down and uh, take a look at those. Let's get back in the hover vessel real quick. Um, okay. Let's do this. Um, let's turn the power on or movement systems on. And I'm going to head back to the Heidelberg real quick over here. And we're going to try to get, let's see, can I should be able to make a larger fuel tank and generator, this and that. Very good. And once those are done being made, hmm. I might replace the landing gear on it. I don't know. I'll take a look and see what they look like and see what they're on top of once I get it back in here. Um, let's see. All this stuff. Let me come over here like so. And I'm going to put, let's see. All this goes in there. I hate that. Um and then speed bike this that this that is going to go in sv parts that are just sv parts uh cvba that's u and then back to hvsv that's these two these will go in my weapon thing and that can go in uh well Okay, right here. All right, and then this can go in here. Iron. All right, um, are you done making those? Yes, you are. Give me these. Okay, let's see how our food situation is coming. Yeah, 33 grilled steaks. I just went around and killed some uh, oviraptors to get these, so that's very nice. Okay. And then let me, while we're waiting, you can go ahead and start making some more of those. Let's just do 20 and see how that works. Okay. Let's come on back out here to the dart. All right. And these bottoms, hmm, I think I might mirror the bottom on the top. I don't know. We will see. But in any case, um, yes, let's look at the back back here. Um, the fuel tank, that's you, will go there. The generator, that's you, will go there. And then I'll put some angled ramps here. Um, and I guess these will be... Blue, oh, you just need to be like that. Like that, okay. Very nice. Now we can put some fuel in you. 
and we should be able to bring you back over here. Let's turn you off for now. I'll take the hover vessel back over here and then we'll bring the dart over here. Um, here's what I'm going to do for now. Let's bring this over here and just park you right here. Okay. Um, can we get one? I know what I'm looking for. One door, the big shutter door. There it is. Hangar door. Let's get that going. I wonder if it'll let me make a second one. Probably not. Well, actually, no. We have the energy matrixes now because we killed some drones. So there we go. I should be able to make both of those and get the hangar door system online. While we're waiting for that, do I have any switches? I do. Very good. Okay. So here's what I'm going to want to do with this. On this end, I'm going to... I'm going to put this here. Okay. And then I'm going to... Have you okay? Go out like that over to there. All right, and then yeah, I really could put it like well, not really. I was thinking like put it on the ceiling and have it closer, but nah, that's fine. Um have it up at the second level there and then this other one I'm going to put on the outside so okay I've got these let's link that um, I can flip this click that do this back here okay now we're going to want to take off these all right, right now, let us go ahead and put this right here. Let's, I guess I'll have to put it along that one right there. And then we'll take these. All right, and we can put this there. This is going to go here as a sensor and you We'll go all the way up and let me just come around and see like that. Okay. That ought to be a large enough thing for it to get open, for us to get over it and in from any direction. Okay, there we go. Um, you, I am going to extend you. Come on. One up so that you can get it while we're there. Very nice. Now, come on, open the control panel. There we go. I know it's got this little problem here. You see how it doesn't show what I'm looking at? That's because when you are trying to extend a sensor while you have a, a device selected and it starts rotating it, well, you know, for me, it starts rotating it because you use the same buttons to rotate it as you do to expand the things. So, uh, well, I do anyway, because I use the number pad. But in any case, there we go. Now it says what we need to do. You just got to wait for it to come off. And there we go. Okay. Control panel. Uh, these. You are S SV door one. You are SV door two. Not and. I want an or. SV door one or SV door two. 
is just SV door and we will put the hangers as SV door. There we go. Now we should be able to get the SV door back uh, or get the SV back while opening. Uh, the SV door should open for us just fine. So let's head out here and uh, grab the dart and uh, okay, grab that. We should be able to online. Very nice. And I don't know which lights are blinking, but I might take that RCS out if it keeps behaving this badly. Um, the rotation is weird, but it might actually work to my advantage. We will see. Okay, so the dart is back. Now we should be able to, let's connect to this. I've got all those that I need to upgrade all these damaged parts. Uh, let's see. Damaged, damaged, damaged. You are damaged. And I should be able to actually repair all of these as well. Anything that's not a damage block ought to be able to be repaired rather easily. Okay. That to be upgraded from a damaged block. Okay, repair. All right, what I want to do now, let's flip you over. Okay. And see what the bottom looks like. Okay. There's another thruster thing there. Um, let's see. Upgrade. Um, all right. With these, let's just pull them off. Let's salvage those like that. Okay. Oh, we've got another cargo box here. Let's just uh, pull it off like so. I'll take this as well because we don't need those or those. Um, let's just do that because we don't need that. Okay. So what we're going to do is turn you off. What we're going to do is we're going to put uh, similar landing gear to these back here and over here. And then in the middle here, this whole middle area. Hmm. All right, let's upgrade that. I think I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to extend the uh, cargo box down here to the bottom. What I can now taking a look at these. I think I know uh, what these are. These are. They're this color here, and they are that texture. So um, let's see. Now I can just grab these. Where are the rest of them? I had 10. I put three down. There should be more. Did you get stuck in here? No. Are you you're not in my inventory? You're not in that inventory. That's weird. That's very weird. Um, because I should have seven more of these. I should have seven more of these, but it looks like I only have two one two i only put three on top 
This is very weird and disconcerting. All these that I can grab. Okay, well, I guess I'm not going to extend the container controller to the bottom. Let's go ahead and we'll make another small vessel uh, landing gear. Eh. I didn't throw those away anywhere. That's weird. That's very weird. Oh, there they are. Ha. Huh. <laughs> okay. So here these we can go ahead and do this and that and then start with full blocks there. Okay, and then the textures. Um, let's see, if I go ahead and texture, do the whole texture as these, like that, and then texture the tops like this. Okay, that'll be blue. And then I'll do the other side, the bottom as well, or I guess the top. You need to be upgraded. Okay. Looks like we're doing pretty good here. Um, let's see, I've got this. So that is this, which will go there. And there. Okay. Let's just go ahead and make them match. Very good. Okay. Now we need to put the Gatling guns on. Um, I'm going to need to take those off. Hmm. I take these off and then put the guns just so they come slightly out like that. And that, I think that is the optimum how I want to do it. And then I can, let's see. Okay. Just getting a look at it. Um, I'm probably going to want to put more containers here. I don't know if I'm going to put something else there. Let's see. What do we have left that we were planning on putting on the, uh, uh, nothing really. Um, okay. I guess that's, uh, seven container controllers that I need now. So let's make seven more. Okay, let's go ahead and just take a look at its CPU, see how it's doing. Really good, really good. Okay, um, I think that will be good once we get the container controllers on the bottom put in. We ought to have a fully repaired start. Four, five, six, and seven. Okay. So that's one there, that, and that. So like I was, like I did with the others, I'm going to go ahead and, and then take that off. And then these, yeah, these are this color. No, they're not. They are, what color are they? that it's not the right color hold on what color is this 
That's weird. Is it this? Yeah. It's this color. Like that. And we can go ahead and do that with those. And then uh, do that. Or was it that? That was those colors. Let's go ahead and see. Yeah, I think that's the color I want it. I want these. And then we had a stripe down the middle. Let's get that stripe going all the way to there. Like that. Nope, you need to flip around. There we go. Okay. And down. All right. Um, that means you were those, or were you? Hmm. I don't know. I'll have to uh, do a little bit of uh, looking and see what texture those were. But pretty much we have the dark completely repaired, except let me get some... Uh, Actually, no, I don't need that. Let me do this. Okay. Um, can I small vessel shutter doors? I'm going to really just need one, but I'll do two. Just those aren't the right ones. I'll do two just in case. And then back here, those... Actually, I ought to put something. Hmm. I don't really know what I want to put here. Something to cover those that doesn't. I think I'm just going to grab a couple of uh, steel blocks. Okay. And instead of making it a solid thing, let's do a little angle like that and so you can see in fact let's do that let's do it like that and then let's colorize these like that yeah there we go <laughs> can we colorize those it as well yeah That'll be cool. Okay, so now we have the dart. Actually, I don't think I want these like that. Let's go ahead and make these back uh, the boring, boring texture like that. Okay, and I'll leave those like that. Very nice, very nice. Okay, so we have the dart repaired and weaponized as well as turned into a uh, scout. I may end up taking the uh, RCS out if it uh, interferes. But for the time being, we are good. So let's see if we come out. Yeah, very nice. Very nice. Now we can actually go places. And uh, let's get our uh, he Heidelberg output uh, dart ammo box. Let's rename this. We will call this the salvaged UCH dart. And that's going to be it for this episode. <laughs> I hope everybody enjoyed the episode. Um, I am going to head towards our Prometheum deposit and uh, get some Prometheum. 70 meters per second. Very nice. Um, I may... I don't know. I may end up redesigning it a little bit, moving the thrusters out where those things are. And I don't know. I'll figure that out. But in the meantime, like I was saying, that's going to be it for this episode. I hope everybody enjoyed the episode. 
If you did, hit that like button for me. Ha <laughs> ha. And uh, if you want to see more Imperion Galactic Survival, go ahead and subscribe. I'm going to have to find out where that light is, that red light. Um, looks like it's over to the right of it. I don't know. I'll figure it out. In any case, um, if you want to see more Imperion Galactic Survival, go ahead and subscribe. And as always, I'm Know-It-All DM. And y'all have a good day now.